WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento for TFNN. I posted a chart of Bitcoin for today. Uh, Binance, which is the largest of the uh, exchanges for Bitcoin, uh, uh, showed a price today of 69200 Other exchanges showed high prices of 70200 Folks, this is beyond the wild, wild west of Tombstone back in 1865, folks. They have... People, you know, we're only 300 million people here in this country, but there's, what, 7 billion on the planet. And there's a lot of people that trade Bitcoin at other exchanges in foreign countries, and they have 200 to 1 margin leverage. I mean, this this is uh, this is such a disaster getting ready to happen that I've, uh, I'm not involved with it at all. I wish I was because I'd have been selling up there at around 69,000. I posted here. Uh, this is a five-minute chart over the last couple hours. You can see we had two, three, eight, two retracements, and I'm just basically showing you that because I will we'll see another three, eight, two retracement soon. But when I don't know, I'm just showing you the the patterns that are there. You can see the nice little A, B, C, D patterns that are going up here. This is just normal market action, folks. The problem is this is an unregulated Binance, which is the largest of the cryptocurrency, is owned by Xing Zhao. He's known as CZ. He's from China. He, he was fined $4 billion about a year or so I go for some things. I don't know exactly what it was. But uh, today they announced they stopped withdrawals for about three hours. Now, stop and think, folks. Something's not right. I, I, this might be the greatest thing in the world and probably is. But, boy, when I look at this and I see what's going on with this leverage and unauthorization in foreign countries, you know, we're the only one that really – that I know of that really tightens down the, the hammer on this. But even then, there's so many things that could go wrong. I don't know anything about the product other than that it's it's one wild puppy. And I haven't been involved with it. I've watched it go up and <laughs> much to my dismay. That's it. Let's get on to something that I do know here. And that, oh, we've got a uh, break coming up here very, very shortly here in about 36 seconds. But what we will do is we will talk about something that I do know here, which is, let's get this these charts up here so we can see them here. We do know something about a couple other markets that we want to talk about. And the first one will be the NASDAQ. So bear with me here and we'll see what we've got going here right now. 